The first time Miguel approached me about the archive was 30 years ago, and we've been developing the idea, and now we threw the apartment into it. It became even more substantial, so I'm very happy. I'm happy it's in Miguel. I'm happy it's in Montreal and Canada. Uh, I think in terms of my professional life, a very important part of it and is in Canada, and has been, Canada has been very supportive of of my work as an architect, so I think it's a befitting home for it. The most important thing an architect leaves behind is buildings, because people are living in them and using them. But the instruments of making architecture, the sketches, the drawings, uh, the models, they're a very important educational element, because that is where you see why and how buildings develop. You see the forces, you even read in the correspondence to the politics, the the economic pressures. And so as an instrument of education about architecture, about urbanism, this is very important. My archive, other architects' archives, you see the process and the pressures of society as a, as a building is formed. I think I bring to my work, first of all, a commitment that architects are basically providing a service to society. They're not, you know, artists who are working in the abstract about personal expression. They're, they're providing environments, they are, have social commitment, social responsibility. Uh, what we choose to work on and how we do it is part of our values as, as citizens. I think also that architecture is not something that you can import from one place to the other. It belongs to a place, to a culture. You know, I've worked with the Sikhs, I've worked in Africa, I've worked in Jerusalem, I've worked in China. You, you work in each place with the technology, with the, with the culture of the place, so buildings belong, they're not just, you know, arrived there. And finally, and that is something that Miguel gave me, is architecture about building. And, and it's not about making drawings, it's not about images. You see a lot of pictures these days, you say, oh, I like it, I don't like it. That's not architecture, you have to be in a building before you say, I like it, or I don't like it, or I want to live in there. And so, uh, the, the sort of emphasis on building and construction is something very central to architecture. And I hope people look at this event and say, yeah, we should have more of that. We should really take a chance on young people and, and, and support their ideas.